Hey y'all, Machine Washable here, and today we're gonna be doing something pretty interesting. We're gonna be reacting to one of my first ever series titled Spirit Halloween Props with Honest Audios. Now, if you remember this series, it was basically just me kind of making fun of props. It was it was very simple, but I would I really wanted to thank y'all so much for all the support that these videos got in the past. You know, these videos probably weren't that exciting or interesting, but there was so much support and it was so exciting just like seeing how many people thought they were funny. I mean, they're probably not funny now, um, but I, I just really appreciate it. It's really awesome. And let's just go ahead and start watching these videos. I, I have my Mountain Dew here. Get yourself a drink, get yourself some snacks. It's gonna be a fun video, so let's get started. Okay, so I have my headphones in and we are on the every episode of Spirit Halloween Props with Honest Audio uh, playlist. I made this just so I could easily sort. Whoa, what is happening? Okay, yeah, so we have this whole playlist and one that stuck out to me that I remember being pretty good was the 2018 props. Like the whole, it was all the 2018 props. So let's look for that one. I think it's the 50 subscriber special. Yep. This was crazy. This is when if I only had 50 subscribers and now I'm close to like 1.5 thousand, which thank y'all so much. It's um, crazy how the time passes. Let's see this. Last time I checked cats wrote on Roombus not creepy dolls. Okay, that's funny, I guess. Yes, Pure Helene Props with Honest Audios, 50 subscriber special. This should have music. There's nothing, there's nothing. Is it just me or am I seeing double? I mean, are they twins or something? That's okay, I guess. Daddy, Daddy said we have to play outside, outside because he doesn't want any more of the Shining. The Shining. Okay. <laughs> so, this, this one I think is kind of funny, but there was this one comment I, I forget who said it, but it made me laugh so much. Someone said, Daddy said we have to play outside because he doesn't want any more pumpkin market ripoffs. Which, <laughs> kind of out of pocket, but I would definitely say that this series is inspired by pumpkin market. However, funny little thing is that we're actually friends now. Like, we talk quite often in, like, group chats and stuff. And we, we talk about our old videos and inspiration and stuff and we're just we're just chilling so that that was really funny i think this this one was one of the better ones from this episode i remember i am slow you could walk past me and i wouldn't do anything fight me the fight me thing i i feel like i could never come up with a funny joke for a lot of these so i would just try to add some like funny little phrase at the end where it's like fight me Bro, you wanna go? Like, it was just kind of stupid. This one was kind of lame. Okay, so just Despacito, really loud. I think it's cause it's like the T pose, which I probably could have conveyed the fact that it was a T pose better, but this one wasn't funny. Sometimes when I couldn't think of one, I would just put a loud song. <laughs> Very indicative of the time, I would say. Okay, so I think I took this way too literally because a lot of the honest audio clips were kind of just like funny things. It didn't even have to be making fun of the prop. It was just something funny. And I took this so literally, I was like, the audio is pretty good, but fix the eyes. I think I could have just done like a loud clicking sound. I don't know. This one doesn't make any sense. I took it way too literally. Also, this goes on for way too long. Haha, ha, I took your money. I'm legally robbing you. We are in the future. Time to get poor. Overpriced joke. XD. Oh my god, child me. For the last time, reskin. Okay, reskin jokes were the funniest thing ever, apparently. There's nothing wrong with companies just using a mech over and over, not over and over again, but there's nothing wrong with companies reusing a mech for a prop. Cause like, I, I would say the sitting scare mech is pretty versatile. I, I don't really see any issues with it. I, 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 I think it was just such low hanging fruit. Like this prop is so similar to this prop. 
Like, yeah, yeah, I don't know. Okay. Hey, my glasses! This one's good. I, I like this them. one. They Must should be, be around, around here, here somewhere. somewhere. That one's good. Okay, again, I took the honest audio thing way too literally. I could have made it the fact that it was like a big spider. I don't know. The audio is good, but I, I should have made it funny instead of just saying that it was... It had good audio, but it's expensive. Like, I don't know. I mean, for the price, he was actually like a huge spider. So I don't know if I can be talking. Again, this goes on for way too long. Hey there friend, welcome to the fun house. We got fun, games, and crappy lunging motion. Hooray. I made it. His lunging motion was fine in my opinion. I don't, I don't know. I, uh, this dollars now because $70 wasn't enough. Spirit, get yourself together. Okay, so the joke is that they made it more expensive. <laughs> my voice sounds like a transformer. Just listen. Viral's nightmares yeah, this one does sound like a that will not return empty-handed. I mean, sure. At this rate, Spirit is just gonna remove my body and make the spiders a pro- Okay. Oh wait. They already have. Funny, this one is kind of funny because like the whole tricycle doll thing, like, tricycle doll, take off this tricycle, take off the doll, it's just haunted tricycle or like, Swinging prop, take off the prop itself and make it a swing. Um, I think it's kind of funny. It's not really a prop, it's just like a bag of spiders. I, I kind of clipped this poorly, but I, I think that this one is okay. It's raining, it's pouring, the old man is snoring. He went to bed and bumped his head and couldn't get up in the morning because I was blocking his bed because I'm so big and fat. What? I, I made a lot of these before I saw any of the props in store. She was like, uh, uh, like fine. Like her size was not like, she wasn't super big. She also wasn't super small. Like she wasn't, she was fine. I could have, I could have, I don't know. I, I don't even know at this point. One little pumpkin smiling, smiling. One little pumpkin smiling, smiling. One little pumpkin. Okay, so in a nursery rhyme. Laughing my ass off right now. Goofy ass video. Okay, so interesting let's go to another part because that one was very specific okay so here we have one it's season two episode three zombie babies this one i remember i made it when i was in washington dc i made a lot of these when i was on like family vacations and so i would just be sitting here like in the corner just like with my little ipad like screen recording videos and editing them being anti anti-social but here we have the zombie babies one let's go ahead and view this one i remember this one was pretty funny to be on to be honest I'm not that scary but obesity is scary so I guess it works. Watch me mommy, I said. Watch me break all the flimsy wires in my wings. This mommy. one was just way too loud. You know, this one this one I I I like the ones where I utilize the phrase like the watch me mommy I said and then that like you c change the phrase and they could be good, but this one, I think I just, I was too obsessed with the whole like bass boosting, making it extremely loud for no reason. And really when doing that, it can be funny. Just use it in moderation. If you use it in like every single video, it's not gonna be funny. So. What's up guys, it's Chewy. Welcome back to my ASMR channel. And today we're going to be trying this hand. Okay, so if I were to remake this now, I would have just used a full clip of somebody like doing an ASMR video. I don't know, I, I feel like this one, I probably would have gotten an ASMR clip and then I would have like cut out Chewy and like put him there. And then whenever the person starts eating, what if I'm, I don't know, this one, this one was weird. I don't like when I use my voice in it. I feel like my voice was so cringy and annoying back then. That's why I'm gonna try to refilm some of my tier list videos just because I hate my voice from that era. But 
I don't know, it's... This part also I'm pretty sure went on for way too long. Okay. I literally say no words, but I'm supposed to be scary what the actual heck Props can be scary without saying any words. This is... Rude. I don't know. Get back at it. I chewed it up and look back at it. No, you walk or walking down the street. Okay, that... Iggy Azalea, Little Sally Walker. That song's a bot, by the way. But... It's li Lil Walker walking down the street. I probably could have clipped it better, but that one was fine, I guess. This part, I remember this part was good. Eminem song. Okay, yeah, works. Mom, 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 I think I have pink eye. Help. Sure. This... Okay, so end me. Okay, awesome. Um, uh, so this was such a popular kind of thing. I know people that would like make fun of spinning head props. They use this song, "You Spin Me Right Round." It works, I guess. It's nothing crazy, but I mean, sure, I guess that's pretty. That's pretty fair. So I think that's the last one I'm gonna do for this video. Let's kind of do like a little little retrospective and just like let's talk about this series so looking back this series wasn't really that like crazy or funny obviously my humor has changed and i feel like as a community this is the sort of stuff that people found funny back then but now i think as i've grown older also just as other people in the community have grow grown older um the humor really just doesn't hit like it used to i used to think these were the funniest videos ever um, and also the parts were way too short. There were a lot of them were like 30 seconds, which if I were to Make like a series and hype up episodes. I would want it to be more than a Minute I would aim for like five minutes, maybe four minutes. I don't know just because it's very hard to get Long dense videos that are just like short demos. It would take so much editing, but I would still want to do that um, I think what my plan now to do every year is just a yearly episode so like last year i did a 2022 kind of episode where it just has every 2022 prop i just make one video and i do a premiere i think that works but again these videos weren't really that funny and i think that's fine to say it's like very basic low-hanging fruit humor and well, I do think it's kind of stupid, I'm very thankful for it because it gave me lots of, first of all, editing experience. I was putting like audio under clips, I was clipping things, I was, um, this is how I found out how to get like audio from videos, how to get, get videos. Basically, it taught me a lot, but also it did a lot for me because these were some of my most popular videos and gained me a lot of traction and really gave me like a platform, which I really appreciate. I, I realize how much this stupid little series has done for me and i really appreciate it you know you can't deny that you know don't forget your roots kind of thing it was just kind of funny so this is a very different video than i usually do i i realized that my reactions were probably kind of boring but i just wanted to like take a look at this if y'all want a part two just let me know this video is pretty fun to make so yeah thank y'all so much for watching and i'll see y'all later